Yeah, just, 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 just push the, don't, don't mind this berry bush, just, just push it aside. Hey everybody, Jazzy here, welcome back to our playthrough of Don't Starve, Hamlet Early Access. Did you see what happened in the last episode? Did you see, we got the Apocalypse calendar to a place, we got it, like, all the way down, everything pointing, pointing directly down, didn't happen, it nudged, like, one spot over, and suddenly the Apocalypse triggered. So that means... Make absolutely sure that you set the Apocalypse off, that you trigger it before you leave. Otherwise, you know, if you get it to a place where you think it is... Oh! If you get to a place where you think it is, and it's not there, you could leave and the Apocalypse could go off in like, a couple of, like, less than a day. Now, I think we just want to make a, make a run for it. Oh, these, they're more guys! Time to go, time to go. Let's just get back home. Ooh, and uh Oh, cool, cool. We will wear the we will wear the hat. Come on, come on! Oh. Hide. Alright, yeah, those those flowers are gonna go. Please don't hit me. Okay, they didn't see me. Cool. And they're gonna burn. It's unfortunate. Most unfortunate. Actually, while they're fighting. Can we run? Can we run while they're fighting? Because they won't follow me for that long, right? And I would... I would prefer not all of them to burn to death so that we can get some of those pigskins back. And hopefully no, uh, no flaming bats come over here. Oh! Okay, so now you're, now you're actually following me places. How, how droll. Okay. Ugh. No, don't. Oh, why? I forgot about these guys. I forgot about these guards. Come on. Come on. No! They all burned. Oh well. As long as they don't set my house on fire. Hey, Robin. And why is it raining again? Alright, we can... Let's drop off the gas mask. Blech. Fine. And while we're here, we can make some food and ooh, we need to heal so bad. We need to heal. Hey, buddy. Get some sanity back while we're while we're doing it. And then And then we got to go get some dang money. All right. So in this episode, I'm going to continue to bring some things over to the place. The uh the new place. Wow, we really are low on food. And I don't think we can make it to the deli by the time they close. What can we do? <gasps> snake bone soup! Right? That restores a ton of health, doesn't it? Let me just make sure that's the right recipe before, uh, before I go wasting snakes. And their precious, precious bones. Everything... that stuff can stay in there. Yeah. Come on, snake bone soup. 207, how much does that can restore? 40 health! That's amazing! I'll take it. I will take that. And, uh, alright, let's, uh, let's take a look at our... Let's take a look at our, our beautiful rock collection. Rocks can go in here. We'll find another place for that. Hey, are you gonna... You're not gonna attack me. Alright, cool. Now, cork can go in there. Where are my? Oh, there are my purple gems. <laughs> Let's. Uh, we'll take. We'll take just a few. Good. I'm very thankful for that. For that telelocator staff. Oh, and we gotta. We gotta refill the. Uh, the focus. Okay. Let's go make sure that uh, the rest of these bats get killed. Before anything else, now that you guys are back to your, uh, to your lovely halberd selves. Yeah. Get them, boys, get them. I was considering sticking a houndius right in there, but it seems like, it seems a bit of overkill for my taste. Let's see. Is that everybody? I think that's everybody. Yeah. Thank you, boys. I was gonna put a howdyus in the middle, but, um... 
it's overkill. We got these guys are taking these guys are taking care of us. All right, and it feels good to get our health back. That's a big one. Boop, boop, boop. I love it. I love it. All right, we got nine skins from that. Not the best, considering I think the last wave, which was enormous, uh, we got considerably more than that. All right. Oh, are you the banker? You are. I have some gems for you. <gasps> And you have some 10 pieces for moi. For moi? Why, thank you. Why, thank you. Oh, that'll be useful. All right, I'm going to cook up this monster meat, and then we will uh, we'll head back over to... Oh, we got to eat this other snake bone soup. Yeah, give me that health back. Give it to me. And then... Yeah, let's cook, let's cook up the snake bone soup. Uh, let's cook up the monster meat. Yeah, I figured I would, uh, I would revitalize our egg collection while we're here. It's easy enough to do. Oh, no, 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 we want you back. Have you been wet this whole time? This, this wet bird? Wait, so, like, do you stay wet? Yeah, you're still wet. That's funny. It's because we caught you when the ground was wet. You've just been wet this, wet and miserable in your bird cage this whole time? Oh, that's, that's tragic. <laughs> I don't want, I, I wouldn't wish that of you. That sounds, uh, that sounds dreadful. Alright. We'll put this in here. How are we looking on nettles? Decent. Could be better. Could be much better. Now, uh, uh... Alright. Did we eat all of... Oh, we ate all the food, didn't we? Make meatballs for now. Harvest these and, uh... Refurt. So yeah, and after this, I want to go back to our new our new space and finish up those spider monkeys. I want them gone. I want them gone, and we can check on the gnats. They've had a they've had a few days to uh, possibly grow their new mounds, so we can check on those. I'm really hoping those gnat mounds turn out to be viable. I I'm thinking they will be, uh, cause it, you get like four or five rocks for each. Like if you wait for them to grow all the way, and. Uh, that only takes like two or three days, so that could be a very viable source of a renewable source of rocks. I'm really hoping that's the case because I have not seen any other super viable sources of rocks in this game, in this DLC, is what I mean to say. Alright. How about a gobble goo? How about a gobbledygook? How about a gobbledy gobbledy boo? Nope, doesn't look like it. Alright. Meatballs for ye. Just checking out the store, see if we can get any more, uh, any more goods. I think I want to also finish, uh, I think I also want to finish, uh, get, getting these trees out of here. We want to move as much of, yeah, we want to move this, op this base of operations over to the other, the other spot. And while we have halberds, let's just use the halberds. Alright, so I'm gonna chop trees for a little bit. Oh, hey! Whoa! You kind of waited waited a, a moment for that, didn't you? Tree guard? This is like the first, uh, I think this is the first tree guard we've had spawn in Hamlet. Took your sweet, sweet time. Ooh, that might have been one too many. Nope, we're good. Okay, now you, now you help chop trees. Why can't I? It's too bad I can't, uh, I can't have these guys chop down trees for me. I mean, it would be expensive, 10-piece oinks, but yeah, as long as tree guards didn't spawn, they would uh, they would be th with me for quite some time. All right, what are we... We good? We good? Yeah, we're good. Cool. Look at that. I see mounds over there. I'm going to go check on them. I mean, I, 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 don't, I haven't been back there, so, uh, you know, this must be... Did I leave stuff in here? I did. Leave the food. Uh, this stuff we can leave. Um, yeah, we got a. We have our. We have our pick, right? Yep. I'll bring that because we will. We will couple this with uh, some more clearing out of the spider monkeys, and I will leave halberds behind. 
Every, everything else, I think we can leave. I think we'll leave Robin here. Oh, and we gotta bring the we gotta bring the ice staff. There's a bug. I think it's unique to Hamlet where um, the ice staff does not seem to cost any durability, which seems a little strange. But I will okay, fine with me. And now we go. Yeah, let's go check on the mounds and see how how far they've grown. Sweet. Yeah, this seems to be far enough away. Oh, and since we're coming at dusk, maybe they won't even be attracted to me because of the lamp post, right? Okay, so it looks like that is they are still growing. When they finish, I will take note of how long it took them to completely grow. But like, we'll check back here every day until we uh until we find out until we discover them completely replanted. Awesome. Rock farm. Rock farm. I love it. I love having renewable source of rocks. All right, so now we will get to chopping spider trees. Get rid of these dudes. I brought my shovel. Yes. Goodbye. And goodbye. Forever. Oh, hey. Did I bring any meat for you? I don't think I did. I'll just leave you for now. I am so thankful that those glow flies do not drop meat. Whew, can you imagine? Can you imagine just how quickly those fly traps would spread if glow flies dropped, like, actually, like they could be fed on those? Those friggin' glow flies? No, I love the glow flies. I love the glow flies. Alright. Wow, I can't believe we're actually clearing them out. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Hey, you know what would be a fun idea for a, uh, for a, a, a mini boss? Get one of those tree, get one of these cocoon trees to, uh, to come to life while you're chopping them. And be like this giant cocoon monkey, like, monster, monstrosity. Can you imagine how, I mean, how much more terrifying can those trees get? Strangely... I have not seen any spider monkeys spawn from these trees. Maybe, maybe they've been, they've been, they've been somewhat nerfed. Because I was expecting to see a lot more spider monkeys in here. Not that I'm complaining, just, uh, just a little surprising. Check it out. The spider monkeys are gone, and so are all of the trees, literally all of them. I do want to chop this one because I know eventually it will spread to these other trees in the area. These mants are becoming more and more of a concern to me. I'm thinking I want to wall off this mant hill because I, they've been they've been creeping over to my area much more often. I think I can uh, I think I can keep them closed in with just a simple uh, s some simple fencing. That just means it would be trickier getting back into the mant hill if I want to refill any of the... If I want to get more honey. Which I haven't found a whole lot of need for. Oh yeah, I'm also picking up all the exotic flowers I see just because I'm I'm done with these... I'm done with these glow flies. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I'm done with the glow flies. I don't... I don't need them around here. And I don't want them around here. Ooh, let's check on the... Let's check on the gnats as long as it's... Even in time. How you boys doing? The mounds ready? No, they're still building. Cool. Yeah, they all just kind of... Just kind of plant them around there. Hmm. Should we wait? Yeah, we'll wait for them to grow all the way. Into big, strong boys. Here you go, buddy. Take some meat and grow up to be big and strong. Yeah, we'll leave you right there. I don't think there's a lot of meat around here for you to eat, so that should be somewhat contained. I want to see if I can control these guys. I want to see if I can have a, a source of flytrap stocks for the purpose of bug be gone. But I also want to make sure that I, uh, they don't spiral out of control as they are wont to do in this game. How are nettles looking? Still growing. 
Okay, I think it's time to get rid of this tall grass. I, uh, I'm sick of- I'm sick of looking at it, and, uh... Oh. But before we do that... It's time to go... Get some more- get some more pigskin. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Oh, cool. And we, we even had the foresight to uh, leave Robin behind. Death to you all. Death to all of you. Death. It becomes you. It is very becoming of you. <laughs> yeah, just, 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 just push the... Just, don't, don't mind this berry bush. Just, just push it aside. You're gonna kill him, right? When you kill him, that'd be great. And there we go. You gonna kill more? Yeah. Just, just, just get them. Just get them all. Just kill them all. What? Oh, I thought, I thought they were attacking me for a minute. All right. Hey, it's me. I just want to grab this meat before the piggies get to it. That wasn't that large of a wave. Hey, hey, da 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 da. Gosh, mashkinch. Oh, cool. We needed a torch. Perfect. Oh, butter. Butter. Yeah. Take butter. What are we doing? We're putting on the eyebrella. We're dropping that. Ew, we really only got four pig skins from that? Gross. Gross. Alright, well, it saves us the trouble of crafting a torch. <laughs> what can we make with butter? How about some ice cream? That'd be fun. Oh wait, we need honey for that, right? Make waffles. Right? Because we need a berry. Why am I wasting time with this? Nope. I'm just going to drop things off and then head back. Because we got to check on the nettles anyway. Okay. I want to set this on fire, but I really, really, really don't want it spreading to there. If if uh, no, uh, uh, let's let's play it safe. Let's dig up just just the the, the ones that are closest. So I don't want it spreading to my drying racks. That should be enough space, right? I'm gonna be very unhappy if this spreads. Please don't spread. And it's raining. Like what? How how hot would it have to be to spread all the way to the drying rack? Not gonna happen. Oh, thank goodness. Goodbye, tall grass. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye, lag. Goodbye, lag. <laughs> oh, that makes me feel a little better. Yeah, cool. Now we can build a, build around here too. I think, I think it's time to throw down some things. Do you agree? I hope you do. No, it's not because we gotta check on the nettles. We'll check on the nettles first. Always the nettles first. Oh, and I'm so glad we did because. Yeah, we're out of fuel. Yeah, we gotta fill her up. I think they're slightly out of sync now. So, we might have to find a way to resync them. Hey, it's around the end of temperate season, which means we're getting the glow flies. Getting the glow flies coming out in full force. And I'm going to take the opportunity to farm Krampus. Hopefully we can, uh... Hopefully we can get ourselves a sack, especially now that we're, uh, now that we're base building properly. Now that we're proper base building, um, it would just make an immense difference to be able to have access to that stuff. Now, do I want a better armor, a uh, better weapon before I do this? Did that... Did that trigger him? Yep. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah, the mants are gonna help me? Cool. I'll take help from the mants. Yeah, that didn't... That was a bust. Who else we got? Oh, no, 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 no. You don't want... You don't want me. You don't want me. Where was... Where were those other guys? Where... Where were the other guys? Did they... Was there only one? There might have been only one. That's strange. Again, again. Really? 
There was only one? Yeah, it looks like the mans did take care of, of one or two more. I, I, I'm finding their remains. So, maybe uh, this is a good place to spawn them around a mant hill. They seem to be, uh... They seem to be relishing... The idea of, of murdering Krampuses, so I'm going to, uh... I'm going to generously oblige them. They must be coming soon, like that one? It might have been that one. Any... Any... I just want to make sure they don't come near my stuff. I don't want that. I want them coming around the mints. That'll that should definitely do it. Okay. Don't take the backpack, please. Please not the backpack. Oh, you took the ice staff. How droll. Okay. They'll take care of you. Did I get one? No, it doesn't look like it. Oh yeah, you guys take care of them. You guys, you you got this. You got it. Thank you. Why well, thank you, kind sirs. Thank you. Oh, you can eat the meat. That is a that is a fine reward. That is that is a deserving reward for all the work you just put in. Thank you. Thank you. This is good. I wanna get a. I want to get more charcoal anyway because we got to set up our crock pots and I've been trying to decide if I want to put crock pots indoors or outdoors. I think I like having stuff. I like having stuff outdoors. So I think I'm going to do it outside. Um, so maybe now is the time to, to look at that. Um, we could do this a similar configuration to the one we did in a hamlet. And I think I had it centered on like two tiles like there. No, like it's like in the middle of like on the edge of two tiles like that. Was that right? Something like that. Something like that. Do I have one pre-built? I do. Hmm. Let me think about how, how I want to do this for a sec. I'll be right back. Yeah, okay, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna set up the crock pots here. And we're gonna have to go back into town and get a few more ingredients for that, and for that we will bring Robin. Uh we can leave the rope here. We might use it. Uh yeah. And we'll find a place to put our, our house nearby. But um but yeah, I wanna take advantage of oh God, we gotta pick up all of these guys. We gotta pick them all. I don't want bugs. I don't want bugs. I mean, human season's about to start, and I think we're gonna have bugs. No matter what. Where the heck are you going, bro? You are far from home. Far from home. And we also, uh, also, I forgot to, uh, I forgot to refill the gem stand. We gotta take care of that right now. Alright, let's, let's refill the gem stands. And uh, I have everything I need to build six crock pots, and we pre-built an ice box for our new location. I think I'm going to use the beard hair rugs because I li I like the way they look quite a bit. Uh, did I bring enough sticks? I think I did. I mean, we'll find out momentarily. Yeah, because like each crock pot needs six sticks, so six crock pots. That's thirty-six. Yeah, we'll have a little bit left over, not much. And then we should have. Oh, we need more charcoal. We need more coal. All right, I'm gonna grab that real quick because I wanna I wanna get to this in this episode. Yeah, okay. I definitely have not been back here since uh, to top off these sprinklers. So I'm thinking the nettles are have a a much shorter growing cycle now than they used to. Either that, or I'm just going completely insane, which is always a possibility. But happy to be uh, continuing to harvest nettles. I think I'm gonna burn those uh, those tea trees that I had going near the hippopotamuses. Because we don't need... Where where were they? They're right there. Yeah, I'm just going to burn them for the charcoal. We need charcoal. We need it. And, uh, yeah, I just don't want to... I don't... We, we don't need trees. We don't need tea... We definitely don't need tea trees. And, uh... We do need charcoal. Oh, can I save the poop? No, I wanted the poop. Oh, well. Uh, you might want to get out of there, buddy. It might be getting a little treacherous in there. Doo -doo. Burn trees, burn, burn, all of ya. Yeah. So we need 36. I hope. Ooh. Will this be enough? It should be. Chop, chop, 
Chop. Chop. Oh yeah, this will be. This will be enough, and then we can, then we can hammer the crock pots in the hamlet, and that will give us even more of our things back. Lovely. All right. So now we just head over here. I'm going to. Uh, oh yeah, let's make the beard hair rug, and let's make the uh, dig up what we got. Oh yeah, here it is. Right, and and let's get rid of that torch. Let's see. Beard hair rug. Three, four, five. Oh, it doesn't take. Wait, I thought it took rope. I was wrong. I th wow, it's it's a really cheap recipe. Dang. A very cheap recipe. Okay, so now we dig these guys up. Oh, I don't have space. Uh, Robin, hold on to, hold on to the seeds. Hold on to. Here, I'll tell you what, just just come over here. Just come over here. Stay there. Yep, you're good. You're you're great. You're great. Oh, such a pretty rug. Such a pretty rug. Pick up these guys, and now I think I'm gonna have to eyeball this a little bit. What's the best way to do this? If we can get like as center as possible, yeah, that's like right on the edge. Now we ah oh, we gotta change our configuration. So let's change it to the. It was already like that. Okay, now it's like that. Now it's like that. So we get right, right there, right there. Yeah, that's kind of, it's kind of, that's pretty close to center. All right. Except, is that? No, that's not even close. That's not even close. I'm not gonna freak out about this too much, but. I don't like that. I don't like it's not going to be very centered there. I think it'll be more centered if we use the regular, like, XZ. Yeah. I think it will be. Let's just see. Considerably more centered. Considerably. And I think... what? And I think if we do it like this, we can... Ugh. Ugh. All right, let's... Let's start with the ice box. I might end up regretting that. But let's just do it for now. And I guess we'll find out how closely we can place these. I really hope I don't have to redo this. Let's see. If, if I change the configuration now, what will that do? Where will that let me put it? Let's be put it there. That's pretty dang close. That actually might be fine. Wait, so if like... That might be fine. And I can do the ones over here. Ones over here. Can I do... If I do that one, can I also do this one? I think I can. Let's try it. Oh. No, that takes away my ability to put it there. All right, let's let's put this crock pot down. Let's put it there. And let's see. So Huh. Huh. Very interesting. You would think I know how to do this by now, but I don't. Alas. Actually, wait, is that I think that's good. That looks pretty close. I mean, it might not be exactly, but it's pretty close. It's pretty close. It's pretty darn close. Okay, so... Where can that one go? Is that... Oh, that's lined up, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It is. Okay. Okay, and then the last one can go there? Yes? All is not for... All is, all is, all is good? I think all is good. And it's centered on the tiles? Wow, this is definitely the most success I've had with crockpots thus far. Anyways, that's it for this episode. Hope you're enjoying the series, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye!